Hi, my name is Christopher Jackson and I'm with Verify First. And today I will be showing you how to place a background order right from your Avatar Fleet account. Once you have your account with Verify First, all you will need to do is access the web store depending on what browser you're currently using. Today I'm using Google Chrome. And simply type in Verify First and you want to add the Verify First background screening extension to your browser which takes several seconds here. As you can see, I have the Verify First option um, extension at the top. I'm gonna go ahead and allow that. Going back into your Avatar Fleet account, once you log in, you will um, land at the dashboard here. And to get started, all you will need to do is access your Candidates tab. Select the candidate that you want to place a background order on. And you will now see that you have the option to screen with Verify First here. The first time you do select this option, you are required to log in with your credentials that Verify First had provided you. And you're ready to place your first order. By hovering over the screen with Verify First option, you will need to select Place New Order. And on the right hand side, you'll notice the extension populates without you ever leaving the system here. And all your information will automatically populate along with the personal information for that specific candidate. We do have a couple of smart fields in here, such as the email uh, address field. It will notify you when that email address is not valid. In addition to that, we also have the phone number field, which allows you to text uh, an applicant, the consent form. And what that does is that helps streamline the current process. So it shaves off on average an eight hours from when Verify First conducts the background check to when we complete it. Scrolling down, you have several other fields that will automatically populate based on where the employment is located. And the reason behind that is Verify First does all the heavy lifting when it comes to um, displaying the applicable forms based off of uh, the jurisdiction and, and city um, where the employment is located as long with the candidate where the candidate is located as well. One thing I do want to mention is if you do not have the middle name for this specific candidate, you can easily select the individual who does not have a middle name or maybe you just did not collect the middle name and you're ready to place the order. So at this point, you, can, you have two options. You can either send the invite out, which again, sends out the consent form and the necessary disclosures to that candidate or if you have all the information, you can simply hit next and just walk through that process. For today's demo, I will send out the invite. And that is it. You, you will notify, be notified that the invitation was sent successfully. The button will also automatically update on its own depending on where you're at with that specific uh, candidate um, with the background screening process. So once Verify First completes the background check, this button will update as well. You also have the option to manage um, multiple different candidates from your menu within the extension without ever leaving Avatar Fleet's software. Um, you have several different buckets here for numerous different candidates. So if you want to see which candidates still need to be reviewed, you can select that, view the details on a report. And based off your guidelines, uh, you can make a decision. Uh, if you like to approve a certain report, you have the option to approve it right from the extension. Or if you want to take pre-adverse and adverse action, you're able to do that right from the extension as well. Also, depending on your process, you can also uh, download it as a PDF or print it out and store it for your records. And it's as easy as that. 